Hey, what's up, guys? How y'all doing today? You already know the drill. Sit down. Baby, you know we went on a deep dive to see what is true about what Kendrick Lamar said about Drake. Because a lot of Drake's peons are like, oh, my God, nothing's true. Baby, it looks like everything's true, if you can believe what the streets are saying. But don't believe me. Because you know your girl likes to deep dive on TikTok. I did the work so you don't have to. Remember when Kendrick, um, let me actually pull up the receipt so y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Let's just be specific, shall we? Uh, so I Basher on Twitter said, Drake's personal tender is being exposed. This video was in 2021. Kendrick Lamar said they be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender, right? And then leak videos of themselves to later push the agenda. You know he also accused Drake of being an escort, baby. So we got the receipts. And baby, let's just say that all these blind items are now starting to make sense. The scary thing is all these tender young things that he was bringing home on his personal tender, baby, were they a little bit too young? The streets are saying he about to be the next Diddy. Let's get into this mess. Make sure y'all watch this all the way through because I'm telling you, they pulling up tea from 2013. And then meet me after jump and let me know how, what you think. All right, talk to you soon. Bye. Her job was basically just to text girls to invite to Drake's parties. Oh, sweetie, that's just the tip of the iceberg. Now, everything I'm about to tell you is 100% true, and this information came to me from one of the crew members on Drake's tour. This was the guy who did all the tech stuff, and he told me that Drake has an employee whose job is to go around town looking for super hot girls. He finds the girls, and then he interviews them, and out of all the girls he interviews, he picks the one that he thinks did is the best then he drives her to drake's place drake has sex with her and then he drives her home so basically drake has his own private tinder if you watch my drake deep dive or have been keeping up with the blind items for some time you'll know that drake allegedly has an inappropriate affinity towards young girls underage or barely of age and here is a new blind item this blind item was originally posted on November 30th, but was revealed by Crazy Days and Nights on December 7th. The former wheelchair actor is following a 16-year-old girl on Instagram. He has known her since she was even younger. And again, this is allegedly Drake. And the related headline reads, Drake head over heels for Turks and Caicos cutie. Drake's latest Turks and Caicos vacation seems to include a blossoming romance with a bartender named Flaka, who's got the boy's nose wide open as he serenaded her in her off hours. On Wednesday, Drake and his crew hit an intimate beach club named Noah's Ark, which reunited him with Flaka. He's already nicknamed her the Pride of Turks and made sure to get additional face time with her at the bar. The evening ended with more canoodling, a candlelit dinner where Drake sang his tune Feel No Ways, leaving Flocka blushing. And I'll post a video here of the clip of him at the bar with her and him later at dinner with her. Now, um, that video is actually on TMZ. I would show it, but maybe I ain't getting copyright to strike. But please believe it does show Drake playing his music, cheesing in the camera with someone's daughter. Let's keep going. Here is yet another blind item alleging that Drake is being creepy and or inappropriate with young girls. Speaking of North of the Border singers, this former wheelchair actor streamed live on a service known for their very young female viewers. Sounds about right for him. And this is allegedly Drake and his live stream on Kick. And the related headline reads, Drake Kickstream, Canadian wants $1 billion contract with platform and reacts to a 20 cent tip from viewer. At this point in his career, there's little that Drake has yet to cross off of his bucket list or prove to anyone else. Still, as he moves into his late 30s, the Toronto native has made it known that retirement isn't on the horizon for him anytime soon. Even if he doesn't follow up for all the dogs with another LP for a minute, Drake is at least providing entertainment in other ways. Recently, he's taken up streaming in tandem with Kick, sometimes recruiting Lil Yachty to join him for fun nights of gambling and laughter. And here is a clip of that live stream. Fuck Drake for the night. 
Um, that's what she said. No, but honestly, though, forget forget about me. Um, thank you for the 20 cent tip, Fardids. Appreciate that. That'll go. Here is a new blind item alleging some very disturbing behavior from Drake. The former wheelchair actor was hanging out with an 11 year old in a nightclub. Seems pretty on brand for him. And again, this is allegedly Drake. And don't ask me why or how an 11 year old was in a nightclub. And the related headline reads, Camila Cabello shares cryptic message while showing off her stunning frame in a cutout top amid Drake dating rumors. You're sorry, baby. Camila Cabello shared a cryptic message to her fans and followers in a new Instagram post uploaded on Saturday amid Drake romance rumors. The Havana hitmaker, 26, who recently spent time with close friend Selena Gomez, donned a stylish ensemble as she struck a variety of poses inside a parking structure. The cryptic message comes just one month after she sparked romance rumors with rapper Drake. Last month in December, the pair were spotted having a blast as they spent time at Noah's Ark Beach Club in Turks and Caicos. The two stars were spotted soaking up the sun on a boat while out on the water and also took time to ride on jet skis. Here's a new blind item that is allegedly about Drake, Lotto, and her younger sister, Brooklyn Nicole. The lottery-sounding rapper needed some help with her music after her last failure. The former wheelchair actor stepped up and in return got the barely old enough to drink sister of the rapper. And again, this is allegedly Lotto, Drake, and Lotto's younger sister, Brooklyn Nicole. And the related headline reads, footage of Drake and Lotto's 21-year-old sister, Brooklyn, sparks dating rumors. Video of the two dining out together set the internet ablaze with speculation. Dating rumors are flying about Drake and Brooklyn Nicole, the younger sister to Atlanta rapper Lotto. On Friday night, footage circulated of the Slime You Out rapper and Nicole leaving a restaurant with friends, which sent social media into a frenzy of gossip about the two dating. Folks particularly took note of the 16-year age difference between Drake and Nicole, who are 37 and 21 respectively, with some criticizing the rapper's history of dating younger women. Girl, and just when you think it can't get any worse, guess what? Drake's even been a creep to Tyler. And if you don't know, Tyler don't got 18 candles on her cake yet. So it makes sense. Let's keep going. Here is a new blind item about Drake and some inappropriate pressure he is putting on Tyla. This one named foreign born singer has a viral hit right now. She is also being pressured by the former wheelchair actor to sleep with him if she wants any continued success. And again, this is allegedly Tyla, her hit song Water and Drake. And the related headline reads, I don't like guys that approach me, singer Tyla. South African singer Tyla Laura Seethel, otherwise known as Tyla, has revealed the kind of men she is attracted to. Speaking on The Bianca Show, Tyla said she does not like guys who tend to approach her, and she is rather comfortable with guys who pretend not to want her. She said, I don't like guys that approach me. I want the guys that look like they don't want me, and they must also be mysterious. The Grammy-nominated diva also shared the story behind her viral hit song, Water. She said, I heard the song and I instantly fell in love. I finished it in Cape Town, South Africa. As soon as I finished recording, I was just playing it over and over again. It's basically me telling a guy to stop being all talk. I want you to show me what you've got to offer. It's kind of a naughty song, but it's the song of the summer. And just when y'all think, when does this mofo have the time to do this stuff? Baby, he's making time. Because he's also literally raining his, his reign of terror onto girls attending his concert here's an update in the blinds about drake and if you saw my deep dive this will come as no surprise to you this foreign-born a-list singer really should ask for identification before he sleeps with some of the groupies he meets after shows and again this is allegedly drake and the related headline reads drake gives away a mercedes-benz g-wagon to a fan at his toronto concert Drake's giving streak is still going strong. At his homecoming concert in Toronto over the weekend, the 36-year-old rapper raffled off a car to one lucky fan in the crowd. The rich flex musician has made a tradition of doling out expensive gifts to fans at his It's All a Blur tour with past presents spanning designer handbags to stacks of cash. 
This time, however, Drizzy switched things up. Not only did he give something away he's never given before, a Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon, but he also selected his recipient completely at random, as opposed to his usual method of scanning the crowd and choosing someone, oftentimes holding a clever homemade sign whom he sees in the crowd. But you know what the weirdest thing is? That relationship, do you remember the girl from Stranger Things? I know Stranger Things is canceled because of that mess they pulled. But you know, we're not getting into it. But yeah, Stranger Things is canceled. But remember Miley uh, Bobby, right? What's her name? Miley Ricky Bobby. Um, Y'all remember the girl. She played 11 on Stranger Things. Do y'all remember that weird relationship? Um, Millie Bobby, I think. Millie Bobby Brown. Do y'all remember that weird relationship she had with Drake? And here's the funny thing. Everybody thought that Drake was trying to get her prep for him. But I'm thinking it might have been he was planning to get her prep for other people. I'm just saying. Let's keep going. If you saw my deep dive on Drake's blind items, this next blind item will come as no surprise to you about Millie Bobby Brown. But if not, you may find this disturbing. The former wheelchair actor doesn't see anything wrong with him hanging out with the foreign-born A-list actress before she was even old enough to drive a few years down the road and maybe she will tell us what happened. And again, this is allegedly Drake and Millie Bobby Brown. And the related blind item from September of 2021 reads, Earlier this year, we got a first-hand account of the grooming done to the foreign-born three-named teen actress. Now it is confirmed that this foreign-born one-named a plus list singer did the same thing to the same girl. And again, this is allegedly Millie Bobby Brown and Drake. And that blind item was from two years ago, and Millie Bobby Brown was born in 2004, making her only 19 years old today. Now, these are blind items and everything's alleged, but baby, where the smoke, baby, Kendrick Lamar is lighting your A on fire. Oh, sucks to be Drake. Anyway, see y'all tonight on live. Talk to y'all later. Bye.